Alright, we're going to start with the ASR-10. I got my, my monitors turned on, that was that click. Let's start with the mighty ASR-10. Had that load up, the operating system. This is what I started making beats with, so... Uh, a, lot of, a lot of long nights with the ASR-10. And for those who's uh, in this field, they know about the ASR-10 already, so we're going to get the sampling set up. I'm going to go with the 31 voices just because I get more sampling time with that. And let's load up. Let's uh, start some music. See, I like to. What's my favorite part of being an NFL player? Being professional. It's like you know, you you made it to. The... I like to uh, let the music play. Fast when you ain't got much of it. So, two hours later, <laughs> I got a sample. Let me see. Let me see. That's the mighty ASR-10. Now, we're going to load up uh, the Machine Studio, which I thought looked like a toy when, it first turned, when I first turned it on, but I found out in a few days that it was not a toy at all. I'm serious. I could tell you this just off a of jump. See how I got I got the the uh let me see. I got the studio uh machine studio recording because I don't have to do as much work listening for good samples. I, it's got so much uh power, I could just let it play. And then I can just scroll back and find you know what pieces samples I, I want so with the ASR 10 because it's limited on time you really gotta have a you have to have a better uh, idea what sound you want to take so you're not taking up too much space but that's the first thing I noticed so. two hours later which I thought it'd be I thought this beat, making this beat would be quicker, but I guess inspiration is inspiration. And
don't know. I guess, I guess it comes down to the operator and the mooch in, but technology is definitely a help. So this machine studio, technology wise, is just easier, more powerful than the ASR-10, but when your back's against the wall, sometimes it's better to move, you know, at a slower pace. So this ASR-10 really makes you, um, you know, pushes your skills to the limits. So, that's what it is, Battle of the Green Lights.